Hello and welcome to the session. In this session, we will discuss the following question. And the question says, A car is available for $13,789.44, which includes two successive discounts of 20% and 5% respectively on the list price, and then 8% sales tax on the remaining price, Find the list price of the car. Let's start the solution now. We are given that the price of the car is this. So price of the car is equal to 13,789.44. Also, we are given that there are two successive discounts of 20% and 5% respectively on the list price. So, successive discounts are equal to 20% and 5% respectively. Also, we are given that the rate of sales tax is 8%. So, sales tax is equal to 8%. We have to find the list price of the car. So, in this question, we will find the list price of the car. First, let us do an assumption. Suppose the list price or marked price of the car is equal to $100. Now, the first discount is given to be 20%. So, the discount of 20% is equal to 20% of the marked price, which is $100. This is equal to 20 upon 100 into $100, which is equal to $20. Therefore, Reduced price is equal to the marked price, which is $100, minus the discount of 20%, which is $20, and this is equal to $80. Now, the next discount is of 5%, so further discount of 5% is equal to 5% of the reduced price which is $80. This is equal to 5 upon 100 into $80. This is equal to $4. So after the second discount now the reduced price is equal to the earlier reduced price which is $80 minus further discount of 5% which is $4 and this is equal to $76. Also we are given that the rate of sales tax is 8%. On the remaining price. So sales tax is equal to 8% of the reduced price which is $76. This is equal to 8 upon 100 into $76. Now 4 2 times is 8 
and 25 times is 100. So this is equal to 2 into 76 which is 152 upon 25 dollars and this is equal to 6.08 dollars. So therefore price to be paid is equal to the reduced price which is $76 plus the sales tax which is $6.08. This is equal to $82.08. Now we had assumed the marked price of the car to be $100. And we got the total price of $82.08. So we can say that when total price of the car is $82.08, the marked price is equal to $100. Now in the question we are given the total price and we have to find the list price or the marked price. So when total price is $13,789.44, the marked price is equal to 100 upon 82.08 into 13,789.44 dollars. Now we remove the decimals. Now dividing both the numerator and the denominator by 8, the numerator becomes 172368. And the denominator becomes 1026. Now dividing both numerator and denominator by 3, the numerator becomes 57456. And the denominator becomes 342. Now dividing the numerator and denominator by 6, the numerator becomes 9,576 and the denominator becomes 57. Now we divide both numerator and denominator by 3. So numerator becomes 3,192 and the denominator becomes 19. Now 19 168 times is 3192. So we get this is equal to 100 into 168 dollars which is equal to 16,800 dollars. Hence the list price of the car is equal to $16,800. This is the final answer. With this we end our session. Hope you enjoyed the session.